what happened was that um, through my first agent, uh, that script landed in a pile at the show Wings. And the script was the Cheers script that I had to come up with quickly. And um, two of the writers who were like low, lower level writers at Wings, that was their job to go through the pile. And because back, they, they, you know, we got to give a freelance episode to somebody. So they, uh, they said, this is a pretty funny script. We'll we have this kid in. That was Bill Diamond and Mike Saltzman, who are two still uh, friends of mine to this day. And thank you, Bill and Mike. And, um, and they, uh, uh, so I went in and I pitched to Wings. It was sort of in its, I think it had already done a season of seven. It was now in its second season. So I went in and I was very prepared. And, uh, and they, they liked, an, uh, there was one nugget of one story that they really liked. And so um, they said, uh, I, and I had to walk in and pitched to Peter Casey, David Angel, and David Lee, and probably a couple of other, of the Dave Hackle and a couple other big scary people at the time. Um, maybe Chris Lloyd might have been in that room when I first pitched, because he was working on the show then. And um, uh, they liked, it. they liked, they, you know, you go in and you pitch, they go, go great, great, we, you know, we like that, da, da, da. Um, let us get back to you, okay. So now I hear back from them, and they say, come on in, we liked, that story, let's come in and see if we can work it out. And we went in and we sat in, I sat in down in the, in David Angel's office with them. And we start talking about the story. And uh, very soon the place goes just dead quiet. And it just kind of loses any momentum we had. And I'm sitting around and I'm like, oh, this is not going well. This is not going well. Well, what I came to know later on was that happened all the time there that it was a very quiet thinky place a lot of rooms are you know people screaming this was like a all right let us let's think about that for a while and and that was that process but i came out of there with beats of a story i wrote it very excited um when i came back to turn in the script they said it was on a wednesday it was on a Friday or something, they said, you know, we're shooting our show the following Tuesday. I hope I'm getting my days right. The season premiered. Do you want to come and sit in the audience? Because I'd never been to a taping before. And I said, yeah, of course. Thank you. And, um, and I was really excited. So I was now living my, uh, I was now living with uh, my, my, girl, my girlfriend from Chicago different one from the college one. Um, I met my wife, Krista, uh, back when we were doing advertising, and then she moved out. At this point, we weren't married, but she moved out, and we were living together. And I came home, and I was really excited, like they invited me to, to come sit there in the audience. And over the course of the weekend, it dawned on me that they invited me before they read my script. And I'm like, what if they don't like the script? And, and they don't, you know, it's this could be a disaster. And I started getting really nervous about it. I show up and they, there's a seat for me in the front row of the bleachers and the whole thing. And, um, and I was terrified, not of me, but I, I was so excited. I couldn't believe that there was a set for a show. And I, and I could not believe I, my, my, my heart was pounding. I could feel it in my neck, um, that these actors were to walk out and perform right here and it's gonna be on TV. It was almost overwhelming to me. And, uh, but the whole time I'm, I'm like, I could see people kind of like waving to me. I'm like, I don't think they liked it. I don't think they liked it. I'm like, you know, I'm really not fully enjoying the experience because I'm going, this is, you know, and occasionally someone would go by and go, hey, nice job, you know, and go, that didn't seem real. That seemed polite, you know, and, um, three and a half hours of this, whatever, show ends, and uh, David Angel uh, says, hey, Steve, uh, you want to come down to the stage and, you know, see the set? And uh, sure, so I walked down, he said, can I talk to you for a second? I'm like, oh, no, this doesn't feel good. And uh, he walked over and he said, uh, I just want to tell you, we all thought you did a great job on the script, and uh, we'd like you to join our staff. 
you know. Wow. So that. <clears throat> that's a big moment. So. <clears throat> That was a good day. <laughs>